a window into the past and a major piece of transit history for Los Angeles. Tonight, Desmond Shaw and SkyCal is over at Union Station <laughs> in downtown LA. We'll take a look at this transit hub in downtown Los Angeles. This, of course, is Union Station, opened in 1939. It is the largest railroad passenger terminal in the western United States, serving more than 100,000 people every day. L.A. voters chose to build this gorgeous building back in 1926, and what a stunner they decided to build here with its blend of Art Deco, Mission Revival, and Spanish colonial styles. You just got to love the tower uh, right up here along Alameda Street. So iconic. And uh, when you step inside this building, it really is like a window into the past. It is so well preserved. All the mahogany benches and massive uh, Art Deco chandeliers really is a breathtaking building inside and out. Not just one of the most beautiful, but it was definitely one of the most important buildings in L.A. when it first opened. This was before freeways and before airplane travel was very common. So uh, chances are, if you were headed to or from L.A., you came through a Union Station, maybe along one of the old red car lines, or if you were lucky, you took the old Super Chief Luxury Railway which was known as the Railway to the Stars, uh, ferrying uh, Hollywood insiders and uh, other luminaries between L.A. and Chicago. Speaking of Hollywood, the 93rd Annual Academy Awards were held here in a scaled-down ceremony, and so many movies have had scenes filmed here at one time or another, like Blade Runner, Pearl Harbor, and Batman. These days, it is the Metrolink and Metro Light rail lines that all connect here at Union Station. And maybe you've heard of the plans to build a gondola, of all things, from Union Station to the Dodger Stadium parking lot that could ferry up to 5,000 people from here to Chavez Ravine. And you would finally have an option to not have to sit in that horrific gridlock getting to a Dodger game or to a, a huge concert event. And we're told it would be 100% privately financed and would be free if it is ever built. We'll see if it will be because it has encountered some resistance from residents in the Chinatown community. But a well-preserved window to the past that is also a linchpin of our mass transit system, Union Station, definitely an awesome part of the fabric of downtown Los Angeles. Taking a look at this from SkyCal, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at lookatthis at cbs.com.